Ay. He's a not with a come up on the water. Not a strong not with still. Definitely see this thing I go so. Walk the sea. Place over cast. Water white. White in a shallow here. No over there some sea yet. Over there look like it. You can see. You can see the difference. And see all of the rock patches down there. The sandy area. Tell me, say 17 kilometers per hour in this time. A slight wind, you know. You know that early, about 9 o'clock. You know. I mean, I get nervous and up in the evening, like 1 2 o'clock, it's our cut off. Tomorrow, the same thing, up in the evening, it's our cut off. But I don't stay in the water till 1 2 o'clock today. Maybe when I come out, I might see a little bit of bumps in it or I feel it here. I have a slide in my head. So I prepare myself, you know. Me alone, it's a solo dive this morning. You guys know this stuff. I feel so ready, you know. I feel like I want to see some fish today, you know. I feel like I want to see some fish today, you know. Yeah, one boat to see on the water, one boat out of the wreck. It's different. But it's scuba diving. You see no fisherman. You have no fisherman in the water. What was the water going on? What was the sea little bit? So what? Uh, Alright, my people, so do you enjoy this video? As you said, if you have checked to see if you subscribe, and you haven't already, please consider doing this, alright? The next boat came to the, the, the ship, a bigger one. These are all, all hotel boats, though. these are guests, people are the scuba diving. There's the next one coming around here. So no fisherman. So this dive was a short dive, so I was trying to spear as much fish as I could. Right here I saw Pinky. It was hiding. This one start the dive. Second fish. A nice butterfish. Butterfish are a species of groupers. And this was also in the shallow. Could see the surrounding. This is a nice fish. A jack was following a soap fish right here. It was looking something to eat. I tried to spear it but it kept wide. Could see it was a nice bar jack. I took a shot but I missed. The water visibility was okay. As you guys could see, it was clean enough. I was seeing a lot of fish though, mainly small ones. A nice red belly swam in one of these holes here. I was lay waiting it, but it didn't come out back though.
I made a next dive at the same spot. I realized that the next one was there. It was a little bit smaller, but still good size. So I decided that I want it. could see it came out here, it was sticking close to the rock. Here it is. This was a lovely quab. I was just waiting for a clear shot. It settled down there and I spear it. But it tore off the line though. This was a huge bar jack, just barely swimming. I make off tight and it turned away. I took a shot, but the shooting line get caught and one of the screws that hold the barrel to the angle and it pulled back the spear. This was a huge gold tail. I got no chance from it. Right here is the jack cleaning station. I was sneaking down. I didn't see anything, but I knew that there are haulers here. And could see this lovely one. It swim off and I took a shot, but I only grazed it. So a nice red belly I dive on. Didn't want to take the shot in the rock. I was waiting until it ventured in the open. It was swimming away, so I took a shot anyhow, but I miss. And the spear ended up getting stuck. This spot is a spot that I knew hold a lot of fish, so I dive here randomly.
could see that huge chub coming from out the rock. Could see a next one came out as well. Those chub were too big, so I didn't bother to make after any. The smaller sizes taste great. A lot of grunt live in this hole also, but I saw none. So back at the jack cleaning station, I saw nothing once more, but I made a dive. Could see this one peep round. I always right at this spot. This one I got. This one wasn't as big as the first one, but it was still of good size. A nice bar jack and I realized that the weather start to pick up the sea start to get real rough even rain start to fall but I wasn't paying it any mind though I was still spearfishing that was a grunt I saw a dog teeth snapper in and out of a hole here, so I dive. It came out back on the way down. This one was a nice one. I spear it. The spear slightly stuck and I went down and pulled out the spear with the fish on it. But on the way up, the shooting line hitch under one of the rocks. So I was paying attention to the shooting line and hold the spear bad and the snapper slip off the spear. That one was a real loss. The rain is up. I realized that the sea was getting even more rougher, some bigger waves, so I started to head for land. But I was still spearfishing on the way though. Right here I came across a goldfish. The spear hit it and tore out the gill, but it still swim off. Could see I followed it and picked it up after. see the rain start to fall once more and at this time I start to head to land a little bit faster but still spearing fish this was a jack good size so I took it and the jack was the last fish I spear I didn't hesitate I just head for land straight after so that's it for the underwater segment
This is what you call North West And people I have to get myself out of this water you know I start to get real worse, even rain start to fall The place gets overcast real bad The weather is going up the sea strong man You can see all the waves setting up the sea The current setting up the sea, everything setting up the sea here so it's getting a lot, a lot worse. Come on, so. We have a strong northwest, you know. I only hope it now. Rough like last. So in the last week or week before. I'm hoping it's rough like the last one. You know what I'm about that one left you know what that. That one you look dangerous too. So. I look dangerous anytime we get northwest in you know, this time of the year the mall is terrible you know you guys can see just a pick up still a tomorrow a bad day and you know, today you know today a Tuesday so a Wednesday are the bad day Wednesday all of the bad weather are come you can see so yeah, what these type of swellings coming here so you know. dangerous right? Tell your people that get bad man. So we come out this about about 11 o'clock you know. We spend about an hour and a half out then this is a star get bad so we come in. So this is how we catch. You know we start finding some nice fish. Now some short time. We saw one jack that you guys see him. Back at the same cleaning station, let me spare this one. Sneak round, shoot round head for me and he spot me and shot off. Move off, but I fire and shot it. I lick him still, but the spear now. I'm going to throw him. I went back and I spear this nice one at the same spot because I love this, you know. It's a place where they go get themselves cleaned up. You guys see the. The dark kids snap are the nice one too, you know, bigger than the one of my spear over here, you know. And that one also, yeah, man, I don't know. In the pan, the spear, but here, what are the thing, you know, the, the, the shooting line, each one and eight, the rock of me, I try to pull the shooting line, and then, you go hold down the spear, and the flapper close, and him slip off of the spear. And that happened with that snap of there a while ago, you know. But yeah, I get to a nice catch, and rain a come, so I'm going get them clean up, you know. Two jack, one red belly, one pinky, and look at butter fish here, and one goat fish, you know. So, I get things needed right, you know, because the weather get terrible. This all past still do, you know. It's not going to last, but tomorrow is supposed to be a worse at the end today. Tomorrow. But this year so now I'm gonna pass. But tomorrow you all get a rehearsal. And I see the sea start again. Watch how it start get dirty, put it. Live. Witness this from me just a start. Mm. I'm gonna check for my boat to come out. I'm gonna take my boat out of the river and carry it on the beach. Because the river mouth will give me a fight to go and see. Take out the river. Here on our beach. It's a harbor still, so there's some. This is not real. This when I hear so now I'm on the road and up. But we have to check still and make sure that it's not right and thing, you know. Go on with this now. Go on pre this in the meantime. Nice man. Nice. Ah. Nice. No matter how clean for us, it'll be a cool today, you know? Start to the jack. Uh, you people still will put off when you come back flat, you know? Because what happened, you know? If you can't explain, what happened, you know? The northwest breeze. I come with this cloud and thing. What happened? Momentarily, you uh, have some higher winds will pass. But whenever the high wind will pass, the rough up the street. That the low part I come back to see the farm, but we have a low part. 
in a few more minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes or so, you can get rough again because the next piece of rough, every winner pass at the circle. You have a time and you have to every winner. If the rain helps to cut it down soon, you can the rain start falling, cut down, the rain will fall it loud there. You see it really rough, and you see the winner do it. Catch her done clean up. Yeah. The back gate to the tall for me. That's a bad gate. We still have the head bad. Yeah, I see, so I get high. So I get dirty and dirty. I wave them, I get bigger. Oh, me I notice me can see hardly way out of sea still. The sea is still kind of, you know. No one then you get oh, big wave. Oh, he's on a string, you know, yeah, man. Because I have to go check for the boat, you know. Good. All the sign of the sea. So, when the sea come up like this, I have to make sure so everything good. In the river now, I'm holding Fred. Get these on a string. Search dive better and you know. here is in a match up in a matter of my cat smile in you know, my people me still have to wear you know little bit over one and a half one point six three as me say you no know, matter of my cat smile me still have to wear it dinner this but I catch far more of me than I have to run out of water. Yes, my people, let's go and watch because I'll cook something, you know? Yes, my people, so what me and none of this are cooking you know? Remember the dog teeth snap and me catch in the previous video. See me. You know? And the goat mullet and one of the jock, you know? Yeah man, um the rest of the fish. Gave them to my mother, you know. Never a big catch, but me just gave the rest to my mother. So me actually just come home with this and the jack and the molly tota to the catch. This was the previous catch. Yeah, man. So dark eat snapper, jack and goat fish, goat molly getting cooked today, you know. Regular, nothing special. Just a do a nice catch and cook, you know. Yes, man. I'm sorry, I didn't get the next snap of dog teeth, but I get to it. So, there you go. I'm going to put the weight these. So, I'm going to put. Yep. I love to cook these this way. You know. This guy has steam down there, and the thing come out. You know. Take time to come, man. Slow steam, you call out there. Yeah, so I see what I want here. A little rice with the dark tea snapper. I'm going to go enjoy this, you know? Yeah, man. So give thanks again, my people. Thanks for watching. And remember to check it if you have subscribed. If you haven't, please consider doing so, alright?
Yes, man. And share with your families and friends. Yeah, I do see you people in the next one.